Hi, I'm Amy Hendel. Let's face it, kids are often picky eaters. Many of them downright refuse to sit or for that matter, eat a healthy breakfast. Smoothies are a great way to get a tasty, nutrient-rich meal in them before they head out the door. And when kids help make the smoothie, they're more likely to drink it. Shopping with your children and making a smoothie together is a great way to bond and teach them about healthy eating. This smoothie has three simple ingredients. Light or low-fat chocolate soy milk, creamy natural peanut butter, and a large banana cut into chunks. Now to start off, smoothies are a good way to sneak in veggies or fruits that your child might not otherwise choose to eat. Things like zucchini, unusual fruits like kiwi. This helps to deliver a dose of natural vitamins like calcium for strong bones in a fun, tasty way. So let's start with the chocolate soy milk. And this is light chocolate soy milk. Now, remember that there are healthy fats we all need in our daily diet, kids included. And chocolate soy milk is creamy and frankly, what kid can say no to chocolate? Soy milk is also rich in healthy omega-3 fatty acids. These are the heart healthy fats that can help reduce triglyceride levels, lower blood pressure, even perhaps decrease the risk of an abnormal heartbeat or arrhythmia. Next up is the peanut butter. I love peanut butter, and it's a really healthy source of protein, and it also contains heart-healthy monounsaturated fats. It's also extremely satisfying. I think all of us love peanut butter as kids. Most of us still love it as adults. And another tip you might not know, a lot of supermarkets now offer the opportunity to grind your own fresh peanut butter. Yet another way to involve your child by bringing him or her along to help. You also get pure peanut butter when you make it, no other ingredients. Now if you have to use processed peanut butter, beware the added sugar and salt. So it's a really good idea to read labels and find a natural peanut butter that's sodium free and low in sugar with a few simple ingredients, peanuts, maybe a little bit of salt. Our final ingredient, I love using a frozen banana. And in fact, frozen bananas make the smoothie even easier to make because it's already cold. But if you don't have a frozen one, just add some crushed ice, which I'm gonna do right now. And another quick tip, if you're freezing those bananas, put one or two on a stick so that when you're offering your child healthy snacks, you've got an extra one. So let's blend it up and try it. Now you've got a great smoothie that your child and even you will enjoy. Here's to the kid in you.